is substantial back at it with another video today we're going to go in and do something a little bit different than what we're used to we're going to go in and do a drift build on the austin taxi now i've bought this car i've never driven it before never ever ever in any of the forza games a completely new car to me i've done the tune i've put a tune set up upgrades i've engine swapped it with a v8 i have uploaded that tune to the forza hub if you want to download it it's under my gamer tag which is gr space jnr so we're going to go into the settings now and change that so we can drift So they're the settings you want to run if you do plan on drifting, if you've never drifted in the game before. So we're going to go in and give it a, a little try now. First thought, it's heavy. It's a little bit too heavy to drift. Not impossible, but heavy. Three thousand pounds, I think it said. So we're at where the drift event is meant to be now behind me I think yep so it's just there I'm gonna build up a bit of speed get the tires going and then build up some points so I can see it here let's go straight in and do it pull the handbrake really hard to get sideways and often to pull the handbrake Not a bad drift score up to now, I must say. I wonder if I got three stars on that one. Oh yes! Nice! A little freestyle pull. I'm gonna go over to here. This is my favourite drifting zone. If you have, if you do watch the channel quite often, you know that I like to go here. This little stretch of uh, like the snake pass. So I usually fast travel to here and go from there. That was quite a good, successful first drift attempt, in my honest opinion. Three stars on the first try. So we're gonna go straight up this snake now. Snake bypass. Now I am quote quite a regular so I know the best ways to usually pull in and get the back end out yeah the weight I'm, I'm gonna go do that again the weight of the the car has it just put me off a sink I'm usually I'm usually used to drifting lighter cars around here like two thousand pounds or less Tried entering and failed. I want to rewind and try that one again. You've got to get the rhythm flowing, and once you just get that good angle that you need to get. Third gear is too much for it. Once you get that flowing, get it going, it's all right. going to be try again this is the worst corner and there's a car in my way no mess it up I knew I'd mess it up that car's in the way I need to be where that car is right now to try and initiate the drift hmm. maybe if I try cut the corner tighter 
No, it still wants to push me out. First time I've ditched in a long time. I'm usually good at this uh, bit of road. I, th I do think it's a taxi, though. The taxi is a bit hard to control. Not the best drifting car. I, I think this car would be good at possibly a race if you want an all wheel drive swap it for a good engine in it. I think it'd be good then. But just for drifting, I think it's too heavy. You can't drift, well, you can. I'm not saying you can't at all, but it's very hard. To drift heavy cars. I had to change a lot of gears then to go through that corner and still failed, didn't make it all the way. So again I'm gonna fast travel to a drift zone that I haven't got three stars on, this one for example, and I'm gonna go in and try three star it. Fast travel over there now. Remember guys, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe, comment what car you want to do a drift build on next. This tune is available on the Forza Hub type in my gamer tag, which is in the description. Right, so we're here now. We're going to go straight and initiate the drift zone. Me to do too narrow, it's too narrow for me to initiate anything because the car wants to, because the car's that heavy, it wants me to slide out. See, there it's like pushing it, pushing it a completely wrong way where I don't want it to go. I doubt that was even a two star attempt, needed 30 more points. I reckon if I can stay control in the corners and not go off course I reckon you'd easily get that 30,000 points so I'm gonna try and do it again cheeky little bonus board Still not enough. Twenty more thousand. But yeah, again, I did. Sorry, guys. What's for words? I did lose a couple of the corners again. I don't think I'm gonna get to do that drift so. So yeah, my overall opinions on the car, it's it's not the best drift car, I'll be honest with you. It's there's a lot better out there. I think it's fun and it's unique the fact that you can engine swap and drift build a taxi. I think that's a novelty on its own. But to do competitions, meets and stuff like that, I just I think there's a whole lot of other cars that's a lot better to do the job than the taxi. So, on that bombshell, my name's Substantial, and this is where I end the video. If you like the video, please leave a like. It helps support the channel so much, more than you'll realise. I got, I'm starting to build up my likes slowly and my subscribers, and it's helping my channel grow. I'm getting bit by bit, more and more every day, and. It's, it's getting me closer to achieving my goal that I want. So if you do, if you have got a minute, please just leave a like, comment what build you want me to do next. I'm open for ideas and I always reply to your guys' comments. Subscribe if you want to see more of my contact content. Blech. This is substantial. Hitting the walls on the drift build. Signing out. Bye.